Selling my pictures, I ran into Monsieur Bouddha. He was an artist and that's what I really wanted to be. He was different from all those stuffy painters because he liked to sit on the beach in the fresh air and do his paintings there rather than inside a hot, quiet room. In French, we call this open air painting en plein air and it certainly was windy. I got seagull poo in my pictures and my pepper flew around in the sea breeze but it certainly felt exciting and I loved it, I loved it. No artist painted outside very much in my day. They went to galleries and copied stuff. So painting outside, en plein air, was a new way to paint. We were a young bunch of artists painting outside in the sun, the rain and the wind. This is one of my own paintings. I like these two women sitting on the beach. I use thick splodges of paint and there's even bits of sand stuck onto the picture. It was a messy business. So what do you need to paint outside? I'll tell you. A portable painting kit that you can carry around with you in a case. That's very important. You also have to have an easel and a stool. You'll need a paint palette canvases, of course, and tubes of paint. This had only just been invented. Before that, you had to carry your paint in little bags made of pig bladders. Yuck!